Okay, now you can see we've got four sensors connected. And we can run them as normal. And again, you can see all four are recording on the screen. And all four are on the graph screen as well. I'll just quickly stop them. And we'll zero them so we've got a stand place to start from. Now this feature we're going to show you now is a new feature on this on this software. It's quite a useful feature. Okay. If we go into manage sensors up here, you see I've got four sensors connected, two fast and two standard speed. What I'm going to do here, I'm going to, in this little box here, we're going to select a sensor and we're going to pick the first of the fast ones. And we're going to do an operation where we're going to subtract it from another sensor. We're going to just subtract it from that and we'll give it a name, we'll call it difference. Now what's this going to happen to do now? Basically we're turning it, making a DP sensor. It's comparing one sensor with the other, subtracting it and giving us result as a difference. If I OK that, You can now see, in effect, we've got five sensors connected, but one of them is called difference. And I can run that as normal. And this now is, in effect, a differential, tran a differential transducer, comparing the two fast transducers. If I go to the graph screen, we can also see it being shown on the graph screen. And if I take the other transducers out, all I'm showing is a differential transducer. Or I can show the two pressures and the difference of the two selected ones that I'm using, or I can show everything if I so wish. With the with this as well, if I deselect all sensors and select the, the differential transducer in effect, I can also set alarm levels on the DP as well, as we showed before.